Norway, known as the home of the Vikings, is a Scandinavian country whose boundaries encompass swathes of frozen tundra, trendy cities, and an extensive coastline. From its majestic mountains and famous fjords to its spectacular islands, Norway is simply one of the most beautiful countries in the world. Whether taking in the breathtaking wonder of the northern lights or the summer sun glistening on a massive glacier, Norway is a great adventure in any season. You can spot polar bears and walruses or even try out hiking, cycling, or skiing destinations. Norway is a very long country. Have you ever wondered where to start to make the most of your holidays? Then watch out. Here in this video, I'm gonna show you the top 10 places that you can't miss in Norway. At number 10, Nordkap. Nordkap, also known as the North Cape, is the northernmost point in Europe. Rising high above the Arctic Ocean, Nordkap has long been one of Norway's most popular tourist attractions. For centuries, visitors have been attracted to the lofty plateau's wild and remote setting that offers breathtaking views over the ocean. Nowadays, there are busloads of tourists who come to gawk at the North Cape and bask in its amazing views. Immersed into the mountain cliff awaits a spectacular panoramic film that takes you on a journey through four seasons in a landscape full of contrasts, light, and breathtaking scenery. At the top level of the building center, you will find a restaurant with stunning views of mountain plateau and endless ocean, a coffee shop and Aurora Borealis bar. While it can get a bit crowded, particularly in the summer months, the cliff's natural beauty still makes it well worth visiting. Number nine, Stavanger. What do you get if you combine Michelin-starred restaurants with old wooden houses, world-class street art, and a great multicultural vibe? Travel to Stavanger and experience it for yourself. Stavanger is the largest city in the southwestern part of the country, and an ideal starting point if you want to take in famous natural attractions such as the Lisafjord and Prekestolen, also known as the Pulpit Rock. Stavanger lies along its southwest coastline and is the oil capital of the country, while the city and its suburbs are sprawling ever larger, Stavanger has been an important center since Viking times. The Gamla. Stavanger district transports visitors back in time to 18th century Scandinavia. While many beautiful wooden buildings can be found along the city's scenic waterfront. Here you can also find the centuries old Stavanger Cathedral and several museums on everything from art and archaeology to the city's maritime past and petroleum present. In recent years, Stavanger has become a popular port of call for cruise ships. Number eight, Hardanger Fjord. The Hardanger Fjord is the fifth longest fjord in the world and the second longest fjord in Norway. It is located in Vestland County in the Hardanger region. The fjord stretches 179 kilometers from the Atlantic Ocean into the mountainous interior of Norway along the Hardanger Vita Plateau. The innermost point of the fjord reaches the town of Odda, with picturesque fruit farms and small charming villages lined along the fjord. Hardanger Fjord is a worthy carrier of the title, the Shining Queen. This is a place that attracts hikers because of its spectacular hiking highlights. Number seven, Sognefjord. Nicknamed the King of the Fjords, Sognefjord in Vestland County is the largest and deepest fjord in the whole of Norway. Stretching over 200 kilometers in length, it cuts through the west of the country, all the way from the North Sea to the alpine peaks of Jotunheimen. In total, the fjord system boasts more coastline than the French and Italian Rivieras combined. As such, it is home to everything from dramatic cliff faces and sweeping valleys to sparkling waterfalls, picturesque pastures, and secluded towns and villages. At its deepest point, the fjord plunges to 1,308 meters, while some branches are much shallower and narrower. Each section has its own unique look, feel, and attractions. Number six, Svalbard. Svalbard is a group of islands located between the Arctic Ocean, Barents Sea, Greenland Sea, and the Norwegian Sea. The islands have been under Norwegian rule since 1920. Its settlements are the northernmost permanently inhabited spots on the planet, far more northerly than any part of Alaska and all but a few of Canada's Arctic islands. The combined permanent population is less than 3,000, nearly all of which is concentrated in the main settlements of Longyearbyen and Barentsburg on Spitsbergen. Svalbard's visitors come mostly to experience Arctic nature at its rawest and most powerful. 
The islands feature untouched glaciers and craggy mountains, but also amazing wildlife such as polar bears, caribou, reindeer, polar foxes, whales, seals, and walruses. Svalbard is mainly known for its three seasons, polar summer, northern lights winter, and sunny winter. Each season has its unique charms and characteristics. Number five, Bergen. Set in a stunning spot on the west coast of Norway, Bergen is surrounded by the spectacular Seven Mountains, with several fjords and forests surrounding it. Once part of the Hanseatic League, it has long been an important trading hub and seaport and is now the second largest city in the country. The best place to explore its seafaring history and heritage is at the beautifully preserved Bergen, which lies on the eastern side of Vagen Harbor. You'll find colorfully painted wooden merchants' homes and warehouses, as well as a couple of great museums, restaurants, and bars. In addition to its famous photogenic waterfront, the city has an interesting fortress for you to check out as well as some marvelous medieval churches. Bergen has a vivacious and youthful feel because of its large student population. While its bar and nightlife scene is certainly worth delving into, the gorgeous scenery surrounding the city is also lovely to hike around. A quick trip up Bergen's popular funicular is a good way to get oriented in the place known as the Gateway to the Fjords. Number four, Geirangerfjord. One of the most famous and photographed fjords in the whole of Norway, Geirangerfjord lies in the west of the country in the Sunmore region. A very popular tourist site, it boasts breathtaking scenery with gigantic cliffs, sparkling waterfalls, and dazzling blue waters all on show. Part of the sprawling Storfjorden system, it stretches over 15 kilometers, with steep mountains and jagged peaks lying to either side of it. Plunging down its cliff faces are a number of lovely waterfalls, of which Suter and Seven Sisters Falls are the picks of the bunch. At either end of the fjord lie the scenic and secluded villages of Giranger and Hellesilt. Due to its awe-inspiring beauty, many cruise ships and sightseeing tours pass through the fjord, particularly during the sunny summer months. While basking in the scenery from aboard the deck is a fantastic experience, it is well worth hiking up some of the prominent peaks and plateaus such as Dalsniba and Ornisvingen for the incredible views. And number three, Tromsø. The largest city in northern Norway, Tromsø is renowned both for its large number of 18th century wooden houses and for the beauty of its natural surroundings. Most of the city is situated on the island of Tromsøya, where visitors can explore several fine museums and stroll through stunning birch tree forests. The Arctic Aquarium Polaria and the Polar Museum are popular attractions in this city located 350 km north of the Arctic Circle. Tromsø is, of course, one of the best places in the world to view the Northern Lights. Number two, Lofoden Islands. Lying just off Norway's northwest coastline, the Lofoden Islands are famed for their dramatic and distinctive scenery which sees its rugged mountains rise impressively above the sea. Interspersed among its awe-inspiring peaks are secluded beaches, bays, and sleepy little fishing villages. Connected to the mainland by a series of bridges and tunnels, the archipelago is home to picturesque pastures and sheltered inlets with epic fjords dotted here and there. As the surrounding waters are rich with life, fishing has long been one of the Lofoden Island's primary industries. In its small villages and towns, you can find traditional fishermen's cabins as well as a couple of tourist sites, such as the Viking Museum and War Memorial Museum. Besides gazing in awe at the scenery, the islands are also a great place to view the Aurora Borealis. In addition, hiking, cycling, and rock climbing around its diverse landscapes are all popular pastimes, as are taking scenic boat trips and whale watching tours. Number one, Oslo. Known as the newest capital of Nordic cool, it is the capital and the most populous city of Norway. A lot of things are cooking in the Norwegian capital, Oslo, a city that has been given a major facelift during the last decade. Funky new neighborhoods, steaming hot floating saunas, a fully packed event calendar, and several brand new museums and attractions is just a taste of what to expect. With the Oslo Fjord and big forests right next door, you can easily combine urban life with nature-based fun like cycling, hiking, or skiing at some of Norway's top ski resorts. About an hour's drive from Oslo lies Norway's new art destination, Hedeland, where you can visit the wonderful outdoor art park at the Kistefoss Museum. 
and the spectacular building The Twist, exhibiting top modern art, Oslo is also known as one of the most visited and popular cities in Norway. You want to see your next trip? Subscribe to us now and don't forget to like the video and turn on the notification so that you won't miss out on our interesting contents like these. Until then, bye.